Hey there, welcome to the video. Now, if you've been interested in making money online and have run across my channel, then you know that it's entirely possible to make money creating simple books on Amazon KDP. And the fact is the interest in this business is continuing to increase as time goes on and as it should because everyday people are starting to see the massive benefits of self-publishing books online. The low cost to start, the high profits, the freedom to work from home or anywhere in the world, and the fact that you don't have to print your books, you don't have to ship your books, you don't have to deal with the customer service, and you don't even have to do the selling. So this makes it a no-brainer business to get into, especially for beginners with no experience in the make money online space. However, many beginners face a common challenge, and that is finding out what to sell, is it even going to work, and where to begin. But you're in luck because today I've actually done all the research for you and I'm going to show you five top KDP niches with low competition and high demand that you can start selling right now. So if you're a beginner looking to make an income online and start a side hustle or you're just trying to find a new niche to get into, well then this video is for you. But before that, hey guys, my name is Jeff and this channel is all about becoming self-sufficient when it comes to making money online. And right now we're talking about low and medium content publishing on Amazon KDP. So if this sounds interesting to you, feel free to hit that subscribe button and that notification bell so you can be notified whenever I release a new video. With that being said, let's get right to it. Now, the first niche we have is the pet health record book. And the very first thing that you're gonna see is this purple bar right here. And this is a free extension that I use called Titans Quick View, which is from self-publishing Titans. It's a free extension. So feel free to go ahead and go to the Chrome web store and download it and install it onto your browser so you can see the same information that I'm seeing. And basically this tool is gonna to help you with niche research. As you can see, it provides a niche score. It gives you things like the exact total results, exact match of the keyword right here that are being used in the titles of these books, how many books are independently published, as well as information on the bestsellers ranks, reviews, as well as the price. But the very first thing that I look at when I'm trying to get into a new niche is the search results. And right here, we're seeing 989 search results. Now, when I'm looking to get into a niche and seeing if it's something that's profitable and something that's worth getting into, I look for three specific things. Number one, I look for search results that have about a thousand or less because this is going to tell me that the competition is not so high for this niche. Number two, I look for three KDP books that have a BSR or a bestsellers rank of 300,000 or below because this is going to tell me that the books are already selling, meaning that there is some kind of demand for this niche. And then number three, I'm going to look for a niche score that's provided by the plugin that I'm using that has a score of 50 and higher. So as we can see with 989 results, that's below the 1000 that I'm looking for. So that satisfies the first step. Now, the second step is to look down the first page here and try to find three KDP books that all have a BSR or a bestsellers rank of 300,000 or below. And we have the first one right here that's a KDP book. And the reason I know this is because right here under publisher details, it says that it's independently published, which means in fact that it is a KDP book. And we can see that it has a rank of 160,000. So that's book number one that satisfies our step number two. And the one right next to it is 641. So that's a little bit higher than I want. So let's move on to the next one. This one right here is independently published ranking it at 103,000. So that's book number two. And we just have to look for one more book to satisfy this requirement. And we have this one right here that was independently published that's ranking in at 139,000. So that's book number three, but I'd be interested to see what other books are here that are selling well. So let's go ahead and take a look. We have this book right here that's ranking in at 311,000. So that's hovering at the 300,000 mark that I'm looking at. So that's good. We have this one right here that's at 332,000. So that's also hovering in the 300,000 range. We have this book right here at 283,000, 135,000, 178,000, 124,000. So as you can see, there is a lot of demand for this niche. And with a niche score of 67, that's above the 50 that I'm looking for. So this satisfies all three of my requirements, which is telling me that there might be potential for profits in this niche. 
If we go ahead and take a look at this book as an example, this is the Pet Health and Wellness Logbook, a medical record keeper and monthly pet care and activity planner and organizer journal. We can see it was published in 2020, so that's been a few years already. It has a ranking of 103,000, so that's good. And what I want to specifically point out is that it's priced at $12.99, and that's significantly higher than the average price for these types of books, which means that the margin or the royalties for this book is actually really, really good. Now it's 120 pages, eight by 10 inches, all the standard stuff. And if we look at this graph right here, this is the historical rankings graph. And so if we look at it, this is for the past 30 days, we can see that it's been relatively stable in terms of sales. If we go back 90 days, six months, to all time, we can see that when it was first published, it was selling here and there, here and there, and then somewhere around this time right here, late 2021 into 2022, you can see the rankings really drop and it's kind of maintained that ever since. And I don't really see it changing anytime soon. So let's go ahead and take a look at the type of interior for this book. So as you can see, this is the type of interior for this book. It's a very, very generic, very simple type of interior. You have a bunch of boxes here with your pet's information, the owner information, as well as a picture that you can paste in here and some additional information. And then you have your vet contact details, vaccination schedule, and some more other things in there. But all in all, this is a very simple type of interior. It's actually so simple that you could get it right off of Creative Fabrica right here. You can see here are some of the pages like milestones, dental care, pet research websites, pet growth tracker, immunization records, daily pet planner, pet chores, pet expense tracker, and so on and so forth. And this one specifically allows you to mix and match the pages of this interior to create the type of book that you want. And so if you want to get access to this, I'll leave the link down below for you to check out Creative Fabrica. Now, if we take the bestsellers rank and put it into a sales calculator to see how much it's estimated to be making, we can see that it makes about three sales a day, which is about 90 books per month. And that equates to about $16 a day and $495 a month. Now, the next niche we have is the bug coloring book for kids. And as you can see, it has 552 results right here, which is well below the 1000 that we're looking for. And if we go ahead and take a scroll and look at some of these books, we can see this book right here that's independently published, ranking in at 129,000. So that's book number one. We have a book right here on the right side of the page that's ranking in at 181,000. So that's book number two. We have this book right here that's ranking in at 341,000. So that's hovering around 300,000. So that's a good sign. And then we have this book right here, ranking it at 112,000. So that's already book number three. And so we can see there is demand in this niche because books are selling. And with a niche score of 59, that's above the 50 that I'm looking for. So there is potential to see success in this niche. If we take a look at this bug coloring book right here, we can see that this book is sized at eight and a half by 11. It has 50 plus unique high quality illustrations and it's priced at $6.99. And if we take a look at the cover and the interior, we can see the cover is just a basic cover. It's a very, very plain very flat, all they did was put all of the images of the bugs and then called it a day. But if we look at the actual interior, we're gonna see this is what the interior looks like. It's just some simple bug drawings on the page. Here is the back cover with six images of the interior. And there you go, it's a very, very simple book. And we're back here on Creative Fabrica and you can see I searched for bug coloring and then I filtered it by coloring pages. And you can see here are all the coloring pages that you'll have access to. Here are some specific types of bugs right here that you can put into an interior just like this book example. That could actually make sense. And as you can see, there's a wide range of selection here. There are complete done for you interiors. For example, this one is 150 pages and it even includes the cover. And I'm seeing a lot of different types of varieties of bug drawings. You even have this one right here, how to draw bugs. Now, if we go ahead and check the historical BSR on this book, here's how it's doing for the past 30 days. It's been very stable. And then same story for 90 days. It's been pretty stable back to six months to a year. And then all time we can see for basically since August 2022, the sales have been relatively stable. They had almost a year here where they didn't sell at all. And then boom, 
just started to sell. And so you can see anything can happen with your books. I mean, they could be dormant for months and then all of a sudden they just start selling and this book has been selling well for a long time now. So if we go ahead and take the BSR of this book and put it into a sales calculator to see how much it's estimated to be making, we can see it's about two sales per day, which is about 60 books per month. And that equates to about $3 a day and $114 Per month. The next niche we have is the one line a day journal. And we can see here with the search results that it's at about a thousand results. It's actually 1,428, but there's still a one in front of it. So that's still okay with me. Now let's go ahead and look at three books here that are ranking under 300,000 and below. We have this one right here, ranking in at 87,000. This book is at 39,000. This one is at 12,000. This one right here is at 120,000. This one right here is at 220,000, 181,000. And so we can see there's a lot of demand for this niche. And with a niche score of 57, that's above the 50 that I'm looking for. So this niche has potential to have some profits in here. So let's go ahead and take a look at one of the examples. If we go ahead and take a look at this one right here, the very first thing that I actually see is that it's priced at $21.99, but it's on sale for $19.79. But we can see that it has 376 pages. So that's actually the reason why the book is priced so high. But let's go ahead and look a little bit deeper into this book. If we look at the BSR graph right here for the past 30 days, we can see that it hovers around 20,000 up to 100,000, but it's getting consistent sales. So let's go back six months, one year, let's go all time. And we can see that when it was published that sales were up and down, and then they had a really good period right here. This is quarter four of 2021 into 2022. And then as you can see, the sales started to get less, but it's starting to get better now, which seems like it's lining up with quarter four. If we go ahead and try to look at some pages of the interior, the sample pages have nothing of the interior, but I see a little page right here and I can see that it's just a very simple lined journal with some prompts right here to answer on these pages. And as we can see, 365 questions, one page per day, and it's six by nine inches. So that's a nice journal size. And as we can see, here's all of the interiors on Creative Fabrica that have to do with one line a day journals. And there's a lot here to choose from. So you can see some of them don't have any prompts but there are some here with prompts. But honestly, you don't even need Creative Fabrica for this type of journal. You could create this pretty easily on a free program like Canva. And I get even more results when I search prompt journal. You can see all of the interiors here that are ready to go, ready to upload onto KDP. Now, if we go ahead and take the bestsellers rank and put it into a sales calculator to see how much it's estimated to be making, we can see this book is making about eight sales a day, which is about 240 books per month. And that equates to $52 per day and $1,562 per month for just a simple line journal with prompts. Our next niche is the horse coloring book for kids. And we can see that it has about a thousand results. It's actually 1300 results, but that is still okay because there is a one in front of it. So now let's go look at three books here that are ranking under 300,000. We have this book right here, ranking in at 38,000. We have another book right here that was just published this year that has a ranking of 54,000. Another book right here, right next to it, ranking it at 14,000. We have this book right here, ranking it at 33,000. So there's already a lot of books here well below the 300,000 BSR. So it's actually getting me excited. But let me see the rest of the books here. We have this book right here at 100,000 ranking. So that's really good. The next one next to it is 190,000. This one right here is 78,000. We have this one at 90,000. So there's a lot of demand for this horse coloring book niche. And with a niche score of 65, that's actually pretty high and that's well above the 50 that I'm looking for. So I'm pretty certain that there is some profits here to be made. So we need to go and start making some books in this niche ASAP. If we look at this book right here, this one was published last year in November. It has a ranking of 13,699 and it's priced at $6.99. And the book is made up of 50 unique horse coloring pages. And as we can see with the cover, the cover is just basically an interior of the page that was put onto the cover and part of it is colored. The rest isn't as a very simple 
title right here and font. Uh, but let's go look and see if we can find an actual page. So here's one of the pages. You can see here are four pages of the interior. So it gets us a little bit of a glimpse of what's inside the book. If we check the historical BSR of the book, you can see the sales for the last 30 days. So let's go back all the way to when it was first published. And you can see that it actually started to sell pretty well because it was quarter four. And so here in December, it sold really, really well with the average BSR well below the 10,000 rank. And it's actually maintained that somewhat and it's doing really well. And I'm sure it's going to do even better this quarter four. So if you're not already making one of these coloring books in this niche, I think you should think about it and you should probably get to that pretty soon. So here's a plus content. Here's a little bit more of the interiors. And here's one of the pages that might look like when you're done coloring it. So you get a better idea of what the pages would look like here. And then I see this on Creative Fabrica, which is a very similar type of interior. And so this one right here has 200. So you only have to choose 50 of these, which actually gives you a better chance at creating something original, something unique. So if you want this interior, go ahead and check out the link down below for Creative Fabrica and go ahead and grab this and make your book today. And if we go ahead and take the BSR of this book and plug it into that sales calculator to see how much it's estimated to be making, we can see that this book is making about 19 sales per day, which is about 570 books per month. That equates to $38 per day and about $1,165 per month. Now, the last niche we have is the Sweet Treats Coloring Book. And we can see here it has 743 results, which is well below the 1,000 that I'm looking for. So let's go ahead and look at some of these books right here. We can see this book right here is ranking in at 15,000. This book is at 64,000. This book is at 355. This book is at 17,000. This book is 66,000, 12,000, 114,000, 124,000, 87,000, 39,000, 94,000. There is so many books here that are selling really, really well. And I've actually highlighted this niche and a publisher that publishes in this niche. And I actually dove in and found out exactly how they're being so successful. So if you wanna see that video, click somewhere around this video right now so you can watch it or watch it at the end of this video, but go ahead and check that out. But we can see there's a lot of demand in this niche. And with a niche score of 58, that's above the 50 that I'm looking for. So I know that there's a lot of potential in this niche just judging by how low all of these BSR rankings are and how many different types of publishers are doing well in this niche. So if we go ahead and take a look at this one right here, we can see that this has a ranking of 16,100 and it was just published this year in February 26. So it's only been a few months. So yes, you can still make a lot of sales on KDP. You just have to find a good niche. And as we can see right here, this is a very, very simple book. I'm going to show you the interior in just a bit, but let's go look at the price. This is priced at $8 and 99 cents. It is 83 pages and 40 illustrations. Now let's go ahead and look at the interior. As you can see, this is the back page. This is all we get in the sample, but this is the interior. Here are six pages of the interior. Very simple images. Here's pancakes. There's a pie. That's a pop tart and voila, creative fabrica has these types of interiors. So you can just search and look and find something that you like that fits the type of book that you wanna create. There's this one right here, Christmas cupcakes. We have kawaii sweets. We have this ice cream popsicle graphic right here. I mean, you could grab a bunch of these and put it together and make a book. I mean, there's just so many options here on Creative Fabrica that you could really spend days on here just picking and choosing the interiors that you want and creating a custom book. Now, if we look at the historical BSR, this is for the past 30 days, let's go back into all time. And we can see that when it was first published, it was having trouble making sales. So this is the first couple months right here. And then they figured something out. And then you can see right here on March 29, where the ranking just dropped and it stayed. Something happened right here. So if you wanna know what happened, 
and what they're doing, go ahead and watch the video because I tell you they're exactly what they're doing and it's not that hard, but it's just something extra that they're doing to get these types of sales. But here are some more pages of the interior. And then let's go ahead and take this BSR and take it into a sales calculator to see how much it's estimated to be making. And this book is making about 17 sales per day, which is about 510 books per month. And that equates to $54 per day and $1,626 per month. Now, my recommendation is if you're going to be creating these types of books and using Creative Fabrica is to actually make modifications and edits to the interiors of the pages that you get on Creative Fabrica so that you can make them more original and so they're not just duplicate contents that you get from online. So my favorite place to make modifications and to create my interiors is Canva because it's such a powerful tool and they have a free version to start and then you can also pay for the pro subscription which unlocks basically everything that canva has they have a lot of powerful features that you can take advantage of so that is my recommendation is to take your interiors that you get from creative fabrica and make your modifications on canva so if you want to check out both of these products i'll leave the link down below well there you have it that's it for today's video i hope you enjoyed it and hopefully you're able to implement it into your low and medium content publishing on amazon kdp if you have any questions let me know down below and don't forget about all my interiors and my keywords that i do have available in my gumroad shop the link is down below so check those out and just get whatever you want from my store if you like this video please give it a big thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe turn on that notification bell and follow me on all my socials at jeff set life with that being said thanks for watching bye for now